morning. Yep. Morning. Good morning. I don't know if uh, any of you really get the chance to see the sunset and the sun fall and the sun morning and the sunrise and the sun coming around the earth no matter what shape it is. I don't know about you, but I watch it every day. And I was just down there at Starbucks. And obviously I'm not awake yet because I kind of just mechanically walked down there. And as I was smoking my cigarette, I started to wake up, realized I was in front of Starbucks, literally fucking 10 feet away from walking in and purchasing a yucky coffee. And luckily, I didn't do it. I fucking didn't do it. I didn't do it. And I, I know a lot of you people probably think that's retarded. But I don't need their fucking coffee. Never did. Never will. But I do need to see this. Oh shit, there it is. Oh shit. Oh shit. That seeing that sun, you know, do whatever it's doing. But it just happens really fast. <laughs> Whatever it's doing, it's happening fast. So it just puts everything kind of in per perspective as far as we ain't got a lot of time. Whatever it is you got to do to do the dishes, send the kids off to their conformist school, you know. Whatever it is, there's not a lot of time. Billions of miles away, you say. Billions of miles away. Hmm. I don't know. I just don't. I don't. I don't see it. I don't see the fact that it's billions of miles away. I don't know. I'm not good at math, but I don't see it. And I'm sure 95% of the people watching this have probably only seen one of these on this, on these little square boxes that the Obama nation has like pretty much required you to, to have. Huh. Billions of miles away. Hmm.
Why, why is my face not melting when I'm staring at it? Why am I able to just look right at it? <sighs> uh, have you noticed that if you put a thermometer in the shade and then a thermometer in the sun, there'll be different temperatures, right? One will be hotter and one will be colder. I'm not going to tell you which one is because when you do that in moonlight, you put a thermometer in the shade and then one in the moonlight, one will be hotter and one will be colder. And I'm not going to tell you which one because you'll be wrong if you guess what you're thinking. <laughs> so the light from the moon bounces off of the moon and then it, when it bounces off the moon it turns into something totally different like the exact opposite that's like the sun emits Pepsi and then when it hits the moon and comes back to the earth it, it becomes coke or, or it comes off Pepsi and then it hits the moon and it hits the earth and it's a it's it's root beer which has no caffeine in it I don't know if you knew that but it don't have no caffeine so it, it becomes decaffeinated after it hits the moon I know you're probably too busy to, to do this experiment yourself you know to actually you know do anything about what you're questioning try to find it on the internet I dare you I dare you to find something about moonlight and the comparative spectrum of the light and the moonlight on the internet I doubt you'll be able to find it very easily and if you do find something it probably isn't anything to do with NASA because <laughs> NASA's not going to admit to something as, you know, accountable as the sunlight and moonlight. Right? They only deal with shit that you'll never fucking even think about. Besides, oh, huh, found another planet. Oh, we're going to disregard this planet, but we found another planet. And the temperature is such and such. And the uh, makeup is such and such. But you're just gonna take his word for it, man. You're just gonna have to take a word for it. Trust us. We're fucking NASA. <sighs> but yeah. I think I'm up here just gloating because I, I look at those, and you don't. I know you don't. You don't have enough time. If you did have time to do this, then you need to get to work. You're late for work. Get back in your car. Try not to run too many people over it going to work. That's a sunrise. That's what they look like. Yeah. Are you looking at it? Are you looking right at it? Stare at that son of a bitch. Stare at it. I dare you. I do. Anyway. <laughs> Got my morning rant out of the way. I feel much better. Much better. I think the reason why the other parking structure is better to look at sunrises is because you don't got to look at this fucking roof. <laughs> you need to like dust it up or something, you know. 
Is that, does that help if I kind of edit the roof out? Oh man, that's better. <laughs> no, deal with it. It's reality. Deal with it. <laughs> this is unedited garbage. Anyway, I'm going to upload this in seconds. Because that's what I do. Billions of miles away, so I can't I can't touch it. It's too far away. You know why? Because NASA said so. Well, NASA said NASA, NASA, NASA. <laughs> okay, I'll knock it off. <laughs>